one of the most underrated features in my opinion in RuneLight is the profiles tab. This is my default profile, but as you can see, I've said also editing, minimalistic and recording profiles for myself. So for an example, when I go into my editing mode, I really want my client to be smaller, almost to have no overlays to obstruct the small screen space I have for it on my main monitor while I'm editing. So when I go to my editing tab, as you can see, it's fixed mode. It doesn't have many overlays on and it's just clean runescape without the dark theme, short draw distance. There isn't much to bother me about. When I go into recording mode, it looks like this. It is my usual settings without my minimap, without any overlays, without any entities and so on. So what I thought I would be showing you today is how you can create one of your own. You can make your own profile for an example, if you want to try raid plugins or, or something like that. If you have activities like AFKing, you can make a separate tab for them. You can just name it that this is work AFK. Boom, that's that. But today we are going to be making a one for me for my thumbnails. So what I need to do, I have now created it and now I just double click and now you can see it is highlighted the thumbnails tab on the left with the orange. So that way, you know, it has set the right profile. So I'm going to be changing my resolution first of all to my usual that I record on, which is 1080p. I'm going to be changing these settings to fit my usual thumbnail making routines. And now I'm going to be adding third party plugins. As you can see, it has removed every plugin. These are default rune life settings, everything you can see here, there is no third party plugin. So even the quest helper isn't installed, even though I always have it on. So now I'm just going to install my plugins I need for my thumbnail making, which is detached camera, zoom extender. Yes, I'm going to have my blindfold. I'm going to have my green screen. Boom. And now I'm going to go here. I'm going to do something which is highlighting these so I have faster access to these. This way I can access these quite fast whenever I go into thumbnail making process. Because if I switch to the thumbnail making process, I only want to change these settings. I'm going to turn my green screen off, blindfold on, change these settings so it fits to my thumbnail making process. And now I think here would be good enough place to take a thumbnail for. And now I'm ready. Now I have done my thumbnail. I want to switch back to my main profile and keep gaming. Boom. Where are we going? I'm now going to be editing, so I'm going to switch to my editing profile. Boom, editing settings on. I'm going to have this here as a tiny window while I edit here on the rest of my screen. For me at least, who tests all kinds of plugins for this YouTube channel, this is a game changer and really useful tool to test out different plugins for you guys. So hopefully you found this helpful.